Okay, so the place it wants us to go is highlighted in yellow. I don't know how to get there. Let's go back to this then. For this, it wants us to go to... Can I, like, navigate the map at all? I don't think I can. Okay, we'll fast travel. <sighs> fast travel to... Maintenance? It looks like the NSC control room might be closest. Okay. Marshall knows something about Dylan. Is he here? Is he alright? HRAs first. They'll help save everyone, including Dylan. Once I find him. Can you keep him safe? Like you do with me? Sector elevators this way. Will the sector elevator take me to the Blackrock Prism Processing? I can't remember. I can go to these various sectors. Maybe I just need to go to Maintenance Sector? An enemy with a plus symbol next to their health bar is being healed by a Hiss Cluster. So that's one way you can find out about his clusters even if um, you can't see the his cluster thresholds the oldest house is a place in flux thresholds appear with no warning what the threshold will contain is a question we can only answer once it manifests the widely accepted theory is that thresholds are dimensions vibrating on a redacted frequency different from our own when these frequencies match, the threshold will manifest in the oldest house, which acts as a redacted. Others theorize thresholds are parallel universes or possibly our own reality at a different point in time. Some believe our collection of altered materials affects the house or attracts the thresholds. We do know for certain that thresholds are not permanent. Eventually, their frequency will shift. Some believe Earth itself is just another threshold connected to the oldest house, which is actually rooted in some other reality. This theory, while impossible to prove yeah. This theory, while impossible to disprove, causes redacted in those who learn of it, so it is actively denied. Yeah, that's a horrifying thought. Resonance is the key. Vibration, frequencies, waveforms, fields we, we didn't know were there. <laughs> it's physics. These fields in complex interaction, altering reality that comes to contact with them. Ha! Huh. Hedron is communicating with me. He's trying to warn me of something imminent. I've been using every known method to analyze the data. Thank you for the hydrate. Exposing myself to it. I'm seeing things and overcome by compulsion. It's, it's not just data, it's, it's protection. It's benign. We are about to be exposed to a different kind of resonance. Hostile, viral, invasive resonance. That's, that's what the Hedron resonance amplifiers are for. Taking the protection, Hedron can provide us 
and keeping us from being wiped out. We saw part of that in another video, but not the whole thing. Hotline. Objects of power. Objects of power are holder slash 665. To the other slash blessing. We hold the rain slash law. We are failing in translating hyperreal concepts. Secret slash instructions will be lost. Ignore this message. That'd be funny if the message disappeared. <laughs> and we only got the one look at it. Field training is right there. Okay, okay. One, two, three. Field training. There's an object of power here. So, <clears throat> so I, I just read this. Welcome to the Ranger field training course. The course must be completed in a specified amount of time. When you're ready to start, press the button. Is that? Complete the training course in the required time. Oh, yeah. I always did love obstacle courses. Get ready, Ranger. Course starting in five, four, three, two, one. Go. No. Oh, this door here. Forty-five seconds remaining. Okay. I was almost there, wasn't I? Yep. Maybe. Get Try it again. Course starting in five, four, four three, three, two, two one. one. Go. Go. Wait. seconds remaining. Course complete. Congratulations, Rainer. Guessing this isn't usually ahead. part of the course. Okay. It's protecting itself. to it. You need to hit it harder to break that shield. Hit it harder. Okay. Hit it hard. 
Become mine, safe. The copies have been given weapons slash projectiles. Shield yourself to pass slash level up. Use a shield. How do I shield? That's how. Okay. Hold left button to shield. Yep, figured it out. Oh, it has a timer. There's a time limit for the shields. Oh, please fail. Wait, please fail at what? Oh, at the, uh... Okay, I see what you're getting at. At the thing I failed. Yeah, there wasn't any special dialogue there, was there? Did I make it? Did I make it? Oh. I made it. So now I have a shield, and I got four ability points. Good time to have a shield. Oh boy! Oh boy! Okay. I can do shields now. That's certainly not going to complicate things. Oh boy! Okay. Awesome. What do we got in here? I would like to file a formal complaint regarding the unauthorized use of my voice in a state of quality that I did not agree on. The fact that they were planning to use material from what I thought was a rehearsal was not communicated to me at all. Had it been, I would have disallowed the use of those recordings. I want use of the Ranger Field Training Course recorded messages to halt immediately. I will not stand for this humiliation among my peers. I will go to HR with this if necessary. Signed, Randall Pulaski. Oh, what else do we have? Case files. Home safe. No unique procedure required. The object is a guardhouse brand home safe. Weight measurements vary. When bound, the object allows para-utilitarians to telekinetically gather items and debris from their surroundings. The object is currently bound by Redacted. Discovered in the basement of a home in Redacted, Ohio, the object... <laughs> Ohio. That's great. The objects gained rapid interest in certain online forums dedicated to opening abandoned safes. After months of failure, the owner attempted to open it with explosives. The object survived with no physical damage. Bureau agents were dispatched, now confident of its paraner... paranatural... paranatural... <laughs> nature. Blood occasionally emerges from seams around the object's door. Tests confirm the blood is not human. X-rays taken of the object indicate that something is trapped inside, though the images are always blurred, which indicates the contents of the object are moving. All attempts to open the object have been unsuccessful. That's horrifying. That's a horrifying safe. Power plants that way. Black rock processing is this way. There we go. There we go for that. And there we go for that. Oh, 
Oh, I saw movement and I thought it was somebody else out there. It's just my reflection. I... I keep getting startled by my own reflection in here. I don't like it. These windows are too shiny. And the music's still going. Tennyson report warning. Listen, Trench is on the warpath about this Tennyson report thing. He wants to know who wrote it, and he wants to know yesterday. Whoever did is going to get crucified. I don't know if it was one of you guys, and I don't want to know. I'm not super keen on leading a witch hunt, so tell everyone in the sector to keep their heads down. Best not to be on anyone's radar right now, you know? I tell you, not even counting all the weird shit we deal with, this place can be a downright hostile work environment sometimes. Huh. I wonder what that's about. I feel like I should know, but I don't. Atlas Chamber, Black Rock Processing. Right, this is the one with the super long bridge. And all the heavy doors. Okay. I thought the bridge went all the way. There's a bridge over there that goes all the way. Do we just have to wait for those doors to shut? I can't jump that. Maybe I'm supposed to use a different entrance? But this is the only one I know of. It looks like there might be one that way. How do I get to that? Or do I have to extend the bridge somehow out here? That's also a possibility. Come on, let me jump through. <laughs> no, it won't let me. Okay, let's see if there's a button to push. Nothing to push. In here. What about in the other area? Nothing. What about the tur- Scared myself with my own reflection. Turbine- AREA! spooked right now. I don't know why. What's down below? A box. Oops. Didn't quite make the jump. Can I just stick it in the wall over here for now? Yes, I can. it's so dark in here I 
I need to bring another one up with me. Or find another one up here. Yeah, I need to bring another one up. Uh, where did we see the others? They were across from this one, right? Okay, that's not too bad. We should be able to get it all the way up without any trouble. I thought it was going to be a bigger hassle. It's the light switch again. Ocean view, motel, and casino entry point. Catalyst, white light switch. The law of three applies. There's our doorway. There's some other doorways. I don't like this place. It creeps me out. Damn. There's actual people outside this. That's freaky. Nothing in this one. This one's not open right now. Casino we can't access. Nope. At least it's daylight outside of the motel. But the motel's like... Sleepy. There's a light switch here. Okay, so that brought us back. Doors locked for the pyramid. Okay, we fixed up the bedroom. I think that's everything to interact with. Let's see, wait a minute. Chairs out. That's what we need to do. There's the key. I don't like this place at all. It gives me the creeps. Okay. Now we just need to get back down. What's this way? I 
It's a way back down. In a way. In a manner of speaking. Okay. We're through. Atlas Chamber Blackrock Processing. Okay. We need to find a way to Blackrock Processing. That's where Marshall said we'd find a prison. Atlas Theory. The Atlas is a physical expression created by the oldest house. Its purpose and function are currently unknown. The specific shape and dimensions of the Atlas, see file ATL03 for said dimensions, seem to indicate a more explicit purpose than the oldest house's usual walls, floors, or shifts. The Atlas changes form, but resists observation when doing so. No visual observation has been made during its change, and it only ever occurs between frames when monitored by surveillance cameras. That's fast. Uh... A previous theory was that this change corresponds to house shifts and that the atlas is a redacted of the redacted itself. However, the shape changes do not occur at the same time as the building shifts, which makes this theory doubtful. Structurally, the atlas is made of the same redacted material as the old rest of the oldest house. Further observation will hopefully aid in discovering its purpose. This place is just mysteries on top of mysteries on top of mysteries. Okay, we go this way. I hear gunfire. Oh, that's a big thing over there. What else does there have to be here? Come on, you idiots. Stop being idiots. You're supposed to be trained soldiers. Or security, at least. Did I save these people's lives? Or at least that person's life? I think I did. That's good. Speak with Arish. Hey, Faden, up, here. up where? I'll just assume upstairs. Okay, that's blocked off. This takes us back downstairs. Oh, is this an armory? Damn. But I've got Bestest Gun.
Uh, this way? This way. I'm glad to see you're still you. Oh, is this the guy from maintenance? Hey, what's the damage? They've each taken a few hits. We need to get them to a surgical station ASAP, but I don't think they're stable enough to move. Oh yeah? But well, they're gonna have to be. Because we are moving out and I am not leaving them behind. Now do what you need to do. <laughs> hey, thanks for bringing down that... Whatever the fuck that was. <laughs> but we are barely holding on here, boss. How's the situation outside maintenance? What do I tell him? The truth is harsh, but... These people seem familiar with death. The hiss are everywhere. Most of the Bureau is lost. We need Blackrock Prism to make more HRAs for any survivors in the safe rooms. I'm here to check Darling's Blackrock lab. So to recap, uh, death, disaster, and imminent destruction. Pretty much. Today at the FBC. But Darling's lab is just past Blackrock processing. I got good news and I got bad news on that front. Good news is, it's right down the hall. Bad news is a hiss monster has decided to move in, so that's great. <laughs> hiss monster. That's what the ranger said. The ones that survived, anyway. But we are just treading water here, and the hiss keep coming. Salvador would know what to do, but apparently he took a security team into the containment sector just before the lockdown happened, and well, no one's seen him since. But hey, at least we got you, our fearless leader. <laughs> they shouldn't rely on me. They don't know me. They don't know how I failed people. Oh no. You've done a good job here, Arish, but you should take your people and get to the base and executive. You can regroup there. I'll go deal with this monster. I'm getting kind of used to them. Aye, aye, Faden. And be sure to put a bullet in that thing for me. I'm just imagining all kinds of horrific things right now for what it could be. Oh, I need to go this way. <sighs> okay, Marshall, Trench's behavior. Have you noticed the recent tension between Trench and Darling? They've both been acting odd lately. Trench concerns me the most. His sudden hostility towards Darling's project is very unlike him. He was the one to approve all this head-drawn research in the first place. But after Darling unveiled those HRAs, he was livid. I personally don't see any reason not to equip Bureau staff with any additional protective device. Especially not if it's as strong as Darling says. What do you make of this? Have you seen anything from either of them that strikes you as odd? Let's talk in person soon, before the next Bureau Heads meeting. Darling had it right. Then again, Marshall's dead, or Trench is dead, so...